Hey everybody, back again. Uh, I got my Insta smile in. I don't wear it. I don't wear it all the time. Uh, people think I think there's a misconception that once you get it, it's just gonna be in your mouth all the time, and you're like your whole life's changed when it comes to your teeth. In reality, that's not the case. Um, you're gonna have to get it first off. Like I said in all my other videos, make your impressions well, and when you do. Uh, Keep in touch with the company, send a picture of your teeth, you know, show them what they look like prior to. I'll show you what I have in my mouth, see, I have a flipper, it's... So my teeth aren't horrible, they're not the greatest, honestly, but they're not, like, I'm not, you know, green or nothing, or white, but... Um, I prefer to have this, just, I talk way better, I'm, this is very natural, it's, but it's a single piece of the tooth, so... Obviously this is a whole veneer set. Um, I wanted to touch on a few things real fast. First off, a lot of people are asking me about my shaving me method. Um, see, there's a couple parts inside inside the tooth that's it's a little difficult to have. That's the rim here. It kind of gets really thick around the bottom of your teeth, and it messes with you a little bit, which is understandable because it's more it's a foreign object in your mouth. So what you do is you're gonna take something sharp, not this. I'm just showing you as an example of this. This is gonna be something like a like a razor, and they make those th those twin snips that are kind of like uh, it's hard to explain. They're just something sharp with a small blade that you could put hard pressure on, not like pushing down force, but nice solid pressure on it. And you're gonna shave it because it's got a plastic feel to it. And what I did was I just consistently moved it back and forth and just continue to shave it off slowly, slowly, slowly. Take the time on it. You know it's, it's important. It's four hundred dollars, so you better be careful. Um, I don't suggest, you know, digging into it. If you know somebody that might do it better, you know, if somebody has a, a better hand than you, that's a nice person, say, hey, help me out. You want to shave this for me? You know, if you, if you feel like it's being, uh, it's just too much there, because it could be. But, um, there's a couple other things. Um, people, I got, I got bad news. Like, if, if you have, you know, misformed teeth that are kind of big or a bigger smile, you got to understand, this isn't for everybody. And there's a lot of stories out there, and people are getting them and completely bashing Insta Smile, saying they're a joke and this and that and the other. And you know, you got to go with brighter image. I'm not saying brighter image is is better, but Insta Smile is good. You, it's it's what they tell you it is. But you have to understand if you have bulging teeth, your Insta Smile is going to be bigger, and it's going to you know make those teeth bigger. I think that these are more better for people that have smaller teeth issues. I just do. I feel like it. They can make them. Comparable to normal sized teeth a lot easier when it, they're not building up from a normal set of sized teeth They're gonna build up from a smaller set of sized teeth in turn making them normal sized So you you have to understand that if you have a large smile, which is okay You know God made you how you are, but if you have big bulging teeth, that's your issue It's just smiles not for you, then, you know, then you're gonna have to go another route But for the people with smaller teeth missing teeth stuff like that. I feel like it's it's perfect. It's worth the money you know, you got to do your time and, and make it work for yourself. Take a razor blade. There's another side here I'm going to show you, actually. There's a problem that comes along with the rim. There's an extra bit of plastic around this rim. That's so you could shave it down. Take take a razor blade. Something that, you know, something that's sharp. Nice and easy. Shave it around. Take your time. Take a file. Take a nail file. Just go around each one. You know, this is important for you. Take it out. Put it back in. Take it out. Put it back in. Look at it. See what you're doing, you know. Become an expert at these things. This is how you're going to make it good. And um, don't let the naysayers, you know, push you aside. And, again, people with bigger teeth, I suggest you don't do this. I want to be honest with you guys so everybody, you know, is happy with what they got. Because, like I said, <laughs> guys, we all have issues. And I understand. And uh, I want everybody else to not think about this stuff, too, because it's a crappy way to live your life. So, signing off, number four. And uh, leave some comments and requests or questions, whatever you have. And... Like my video, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Take care.